What's good, YouTube? You already know who it is. It's Laquana, and I'm back again with another reaction video. And this reaction video is about my little girl getting her ears pierced. And this was a quick discussion about doing it because at first I was kind of nervous about her getting it. And I was like, man, I was thinking about doing it since my mother-in-law was saying I could have got her ears pierced about three months into when she was born so say if she was like three months um they would have um did it they said kids can't feel it when they was getting their ears pierced at um three months and some people was doing it a little earlier than um three months they was doing it early before three months so some people did it like a month after their child was born but I wouldn't even try doing it for that long. I was going to wait till she was like six months to do it. But I got cold feet, nervous again around six months came. Then I decided that I wanted to get her ears pierced done. And when she turns one year old, she got her ears pierced Saturday. It was me, my mother-in-law, and my sister-in-law. We got up a little bit late, around like 11. And I got, I took a quick shower. My mother-in-law got her ready for me while I was getting ready. And we went to go pick up my sister-in-law. It was like a girl's day out for Ari. After that, we went to the mall to go get her ears pierced. As y'all can see, she was kind of nervous. And I really thought that we was going to Claire's. But um, we went to a section in the middle of the mall. And they had, like, they had been just new. So we was like... I was kind of skeptical because I never seen their booth in the mall. Like, they didn't have a store. They just had a booth in the middle of the walkway is where you go inside the mall. And it was like, we could do the, um, pierced ears and stuff like that. And I think they are a more expensive than Claire's. And I forgot what was the name of the um, place where we got it from. I really can't pronounce it, but... Um, this black, like, as y'all see, it was a black girl that did it, and she was patient. She was asking us questions. She wanted to make sure that we figure out which side and, well, not which side, like, which, like, how they want to, um, pierce it at. And she, Ariana was kind of getting nervous because she knew every time when she knew something was about to happen, she go to look around and think about what's about to happen to me. And then when the lady had got close to her, she started piercing her ears and Ariana started freaking out, as y'all could see in the video. So we had to calm her down. And then, plus, it was... That location right there, it was, no, they should have had a store. I, like, my, like, you could see people, no, I've never seen a place where you go get your ears pierced in the middle of the mall. Like, no, they always have a store. They always have a piercing store somewhere, and that's what I really, like, I really thought we was going to Claire's, but in Savannah Mall, Oglethorpe Mall, they don't have Claire's, and I never really seen, I don't know, I think they had Claire's, but I thought we was going to take her to Claire's, but... We didn't take her to Claire. So really, after that mall, after when we left the mall, we went to Old Time Buffets, and I, some of y'all probably are familiar with um, Old Time Buffets because in Savannah, at first it was Ryan's, and I miss Ryan's, and um, they had Ryan's in Statesboro, but they closed that down and made that into a Old Times too, and. We were really in old times in Statesboro. That was up before they made that one in Savannah. And it was just crazy. And it was pretty much by like 1 o'clock, 12 o'clock. Well, not 12 o'clock. 1.30 or something like that. Then my boyfriend had called me and he said, oh, I'm on the way home. I just got off early from work. Good Friday. But obviously it wasn't. I mean, y'all didn't know the weather, so the weather was raining, and it was freezing, and, <laughs> and I wore a crop top, and I was like, Lord, but it was a crop top jacket, so after that, we went, but took my sister-in-law back home, and we, <laughs> she was crying a little bit, but during this process of the crying, she had stopped right away, and I thought, like she was gonna be crying for a long time but obviously she wasn't like after when my sister and I picked her up she was just so calm and she was um 
good and I sent the video to my mother, I sent it to my dad, I sent it to her father, and I sent it into my Facebook group chat, and it was like, oh my god, but Tony's reaction was funny. After when I sent him the video of her getting her ears pierced, he was like, oh, they gonna make me come down now. Why they did that to my baby? And he was like, oh my lord, his reaction was priceless on the phone. And... That was it. So after when we left, um, old times we just dropped my sister off home and we went home and took a nap. Wait for my boyfriend to get here, but it took him forever to get home because <laughs> you know that he works in South Carolina and Savannah, South Carolina is like an hour and some change away. That was the agenda on Friday. Really couldn't do too much because it was raining. I hated the fact that it was raining and I'm like. Fridays is where I get dressed up and wanna parlay or whatever, drink some, drink some wine, drink some liquor. I don't drink beer, and um, I tried it once, but I cannot get into it. I do not like beer. <laughs> so for all the beer lovers out there, I don't. I mean, I try to get into it. I was like, man, I gotta be a little bit older for me to like try beer, like. It's just so crazy. I tried it once and I was like, but like, you know, no matter what type of, if it's beer, I cannot drink it. <laughs> so, big, <laughs> big shout out to the ones that drink beer, if y'all follow me. I, I mean, I'm going to still support y'all, but to be honest with you, me and beer couldn't do it. And I wanted some liquor, didn't get no chance to because it was raining. So, it was like, hmm, what can I do? Just lay down take a nap or play with my baby like i could do a lot of things in the house you don't really have to go nowhere <laughs> save money <laughs> but if you do like going places like um going see over here in savannah we were just talking about that saturday there was my sister and i was talking about um we got a skating ring over here called um star castle apparently we got more than one skating rink i don't know i think it's about two or three one is in pooler and the other one is in savannah and uh, a bowling alley is in savannah i mean it's in pooler and what else they got a golf cart called golf cart place called fun world that's in pooler like that place i would never go back to because i don't outgrew it i don't outgrew star castle um i think i'm gonna go try out cascade like it was like ever since i've been in Atlanta, i never really got a chance to go get to cascade like when i was living in Atlanta, i was going places like to the mall i mean because really it was just me and my mama like if i had moved to Atlanta with my father we probably would have did better things like going to six flags like i went to six flags with my mama one time with her friend that she had met before it was a female by the way but that particular um time it was um when i was standing in Atlanta for two times like this is like my first time going into Atlanta i lived in Atlanta twice so this was like the second time is when i wasn't crying for my daddy like the first time i was Boo hoo cried every day for my daddy, and he decided to let me come home. And I was about to move with him, but he didn't feel safe with me going to school at his house because my first stepmother she wasn't always nice. How would I like to put it? So I had to stay in Atlanta with my mother until she got ready to come back down here. So. I had to wait for her, so, and now it was just, it was just crazy, like, I do miss Atlanta, I always want to go back to Atlanta, my mama want to go back to Atlanta, like, Atlanta would be the place that I would move to and stay there for the rest of my life and travel everywhere I want to go, so, that would happen one day not right now but one day so if you're new please subscribe if you already subscribe just keep loving me and i will keep loving you and uh, i'm trying to think of what i got more content coming on the way don't be mad at me i'm just taking my time trying to figure out what i want to do a review on 
and uh, pretty much I think I'm going to um, get ready to go and take a nap, take my lipstick off, take off these eyelashes. So I could take a nap because my little one is, went to sleep and that's kind of good and I don't want to wake her up. So I think I want to take a nap and get ready for later on, even though I ain't got nothing planned. So whatever. So if y'all new, please subscribe, like, share. In the meantime, I will see you next time.